Hey guys, check how I got hold of whilst I was cloning. Alright, it looks like a normal egg when the stats thing is up. But as a matter of fact, that's a glitched egg. Um, it's kind of what happens when you don't... Well, when you do clone, but you don't really do it properly. And uh, this has only happened in this game, uh, Pokemon Crystal. So I'm going to hatch it. And either one, I think one of two things is going to happen. It's going to hatch into a glitch Pokemon and crash my game, or it's uh, not going to hatch at all and crash my game. Or maybe a third one, it'll hatch just fine. So I'm actually pretty keen to find out what will happen if I was to hatch this egg. And also, it is the odd egg that you see from Daycare. And like I said, I've been cloning them. Get them away, bitch. I've been cloning them off screen. So, you know, I'll be interested to see what happens. Also, the shiny um, percentage with the odd egg is pretty high uh, compared to 1 out of 64 eggs that you hatch. So, yeah. <clears throat> Also, for people who are breeding for shinies in uh, Generation 2, um, I found this out through watching other people, actually. Um, the best way to get a guaranteed shiny whilst hatching, um, apparently you do officially need a shiny ditto to pass down the shiny gene. Um, I mean, shiny Gyarados can work, but only with a select few Pokemon. So, um, the best way to get a shiny ditto is to grab the shiny Gyarados, trade it to Generation 1, make sure it doesn't have any moves that are Generation 2 related, um, keep Tackle, obviously, but get rid of the other moves, and uh, get it to learn Mimic through TM on Generation 1, uh, red, blue, or yellow. And what you got to do is um, you got to try and find a wild ditto, get it to, tra to use transform twice. First time it copies how the Gyarados looks, and then it copies the shiny factor the second time it uses um, it uses transform. So after it's used transform twice, um, you got to use mimic on the ditto as well when it transforms, so that Gyarados can learn it and uh, the Ditto will have it, even though it's looking like Gyarados. So, um, <clears throat> what was I saying? So yeah, after Ditto has used Transform twice, um, what do you call it, catch it, trade over to Generation 2 and you are guaranteed a shiny Ditto that way. And it sends, it saves spending, you know, possibly days or even weeks trying to find a wild one on here when you can simply get one in the space of about 20 minutes, half an hour so, you know, that's time well spent right, let's have a look this will be very interesting Also, um, regarding sh hatching shinies in this, um, unless it's a shiny ditto that like you're using, you know, you won't really get hold of a shiny Pokemon. Uh, it's 1 in 64 chance, I think, uh, regarding egg hatching. I'm not entirely certain. But um, the odds of a shiny is impossible unless you're using a Pokemon as a parent that's already shiny. So, uh, you can imagine how, <laughs> how a little bit pissy I was when I found out. Because um, in the uh, hard copies of this game, I did, um, I did do some Pokemon breeding, thinking I could get a shiny that way. I spent about a whole day to about three days trying to hatch a, a shiny Pichu, and it wasn't happening. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> it was hilarious. But at the same time, very annoying. Come on. <clears throat> oh, 
when you wish flame body was available. Oh, here we go. Right. What's this going to hatch into? Well, to be on the safe side, I'm still going to release that, so... Yeah. <clears throat> and just to let you know, I'm going to keep uh, doing this off-screen until I get the, um, the shiny Pokemon that I'm looking for. And Pichu is, in fact, one of them. And unfortunately for me, it's one of the rarer, rarer ones. And uh, if I get a normal Pichu, um, in the meantime, get out of my way. If I get a normal Pichu in the meantime, I'll just simply put it in the PC. Or I might add it to my party, I don't know yet. And, um, you know, and keep it. Because uh, these Pokemon can't learn Dizzy Punch under normal cases. Also, my camera's been acting buggy as hell regarding uh, normal recording. So I'm having to go onto YouTube and record from YouTube without um, without live streaming. So it's a little bit annoying. But you know, I want to entertain you guys and I will go through different lengths to do that. <clears throat> Sorry about that, I'm not the phone. My bad.
Ups. Yay, got Pichu. I both hit him on, not hit him on, uh, Tyrog. Another Clutter. That one I'll keep. Uh, the other one's going to be released due to it being a glitched egg. His last one. Jiggly buff. That's pretty cute. That isn't. Okay, so yeah, this is basically what I'm going to be doing um, between um, the Let's Play thing. So let's just save this. Actually, let's not. First. If you're wondering why I've named it that, that was when I first got the egg. So, um, yeah, any glitched eggs that I've got, they will be going in that dangerous box in case my game gets crashed or corrupted or whatever. Uh, I don't want it. Well, you know what, forget it. So yeah, that's all that dealt with. Oh wait a minute. Yeah, I put the cloned eggs in this box. Uh, 
and this is basically the um, egg grinding I plan on doing. So uh, wish me luck getting the target shiny that I'm after.